Well, hi everybody. Well, today I'm making something very unusual called baked rice pudding. A lot of times I made rice pudding, folks. Keep this in mind. If you put it in the refrigerator right after you make it, it will not come out. You have to bake it. So I'm using four eggs. Now, after it comes out of the oven, folks, keep this in mind. You have to chill it. Now, hopefully this solves the problem with the rice. I don't know. I've never made this recipe before. Well, let's see what happens today. Rice pudding is fantastic. You can always get it in the diner. When you go to a diner or something, you always get rice pudding. I always order it. I always have a little bit of whipped cream on it. It's a wonderful, wonderful dish. Okay. Now, the next thing I have to do is add in my sugar. Three-fourths cup of granulated sugar. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to mix this together before I add in my milk and my cinnamon and my rice. Here we go. Okay, now it's all mixed together, the sugar and the egg. The next thing I want to add in is going to be my milk. Now, it says three, it says three cups of whole milk. I'm going a little bit less. We don't want it overly watery either. There we go. A little bit more. And that's it. If it's too watery, it's not going to come out either. So, next thing I have to do is mix it. Okay. Now, the rice is what, it's what's going to pull it together. I think we're just going to make it. One. Folks, we're just going to pull the whole thing in here. All right. I'm going to mix this together. Very water and have to cook for about an hour. have a little bit more rice if not a vanilla folks it's very watery but it has to uh, bake for an hour in the oven and then the rice will definitely absorb the uh the milk okay so mix this together it's very watery you can see that folks this has to cook for about an hour and i know how rice is all right now the next thing is i have to add in a uh, cinnamon i have to add in two teaspoons of cinnamon Cinnamon and rice pudding go, go hand in hand, you know that. Now we're going to mix this together. Now folks, like I said, it's very watery, folks. Whenever you make rice, it has to, it's very watery, of course, you know that. But then it absorbs in and it becomes very thick. Okay. Mix, mix. Now we're going to put this in the baking pan. And this is going to take about 45 minutes. Here's the rice, here's the rice, right here. All right, it's very watery, 45 minutes. Rice pudding, folks, we added a little bit too much liquid. Now, if you don't have enough rice, take some of the rice out, put it into a saucepan with a little bit of liquid, and it will come a masterpiece. Look how beautiful that is. I'm to more with my whipped cream. And we have pros, we just, oh, careful. Here we go. Happens. And here you have delicious, wonderful rice pudding. Keep it in the refrigerator for many hours. It will be delicious. But if you don't have enough liquid, you have too much liquid, don't panic. If you put some into the saucepan, it will come out to be delicious. Then, boy, Tom Country, have a great day. Please subscribe to my wonderful YouTube channel.